in the quaint village of Serenwood, nestled between rolling hills and babbling brooks, lived a young girl named Elara. Elara had always been fascinated by the concept of time. She often found herself pondering the passing seconds, minutes, and hours, wondering about the potential each moment held. One bright morning, as the sun painted the sky with hues of gold and rose, Elara set out on a path that led to the village's grand library. She hoped to discover the secrets of time within its ancient tomes. Inside the library, she met the wise librarian, Mr. Thistledown. With a knowing smile, he welcomed her and led her to a special section on the philosophy of time. As Elara delved into the books, her fascination deepened. She learned about the impermanence of every moment, how each second was a fresh canvas waiting to be painted upon. Yet, she also came across a parable that would forever change her perspective. The parable told the tale of a skilled painter named Elio, renowned for his exquisite landscapes. One day, Elio stumbled upon a rare type of paint that promised to capture the essence of a moment in time. Eager to test its magic, he set off to a nearby meadow at sunrise. As the first rays of sunlight kissed the earth, Elio dipped his brush into the paint and began to create. He captured the way the dew glistened on the grass, the stillness of the morning air, and the fleeting beauty of a butterfly resting on a flower. Each brush stroke seemed to trap the moment within the canvas. Days turned into weeks, and Elio continued to paint, entranced by the power of the paint. But as he painted, he began to notice something peculiar. The scenes he had captured started to lose their vibrancy. The dew no longer sparkled. The air no longer felt still. And the butterfly lost its delicate grace. The magic paint was fading. And so were the captured moments. Disturbed and disappointed, Elio sought the guidance of a wise sage. The sage listened to his story and then gently smiled. My dear painter, you have learned a valuable lesson, he said. Time is a river that flows endlessly. Moments cannot be trapped in paint or words. For they are meant to be experienced, cherished, and then released to make space for new ones. Elio's heart sank as he realized the truth in the sage's words. He returned to the meadow with fresh resolve, this time without the magical paint. He gazed at the sunrise, embracing its beauty, and decided to paint the moment not on canvas, but in his heart and soul. With every stroke of his brush, he celebrated the impermanence of the scene before him. Elara closed the book and sat in contemplation. She realized that every moment was indeed a fresh beginning. A canvas waiting for her to paint her experiences, emotions, and memories. She understood that trying to capture a moment was like trying to trap a butterfly. It diminished its true essence. From that day on, Elara approached life with a newfound awareness. She embraced each moment as a gift, a chance to experience something unique and beautiful. She learned to cherish the fleeting nature of time and to create her own masterpiece with every passing second. As she returned to her village, she carried the wisdom of the parable and the philosophy of time in her heart. And as the years rolled on, Elara became known as the village storyteller. Sharing her tales of the impermanence of moments and the beauty of embracing each fresh beginning. And so, in the village of Serenwood, the story of Elara and the parable of Elio became intertwined. A reminder that life's most profound lessons often come from understanding the fluid nature of time. And the boundless potential held within every moment.